everyone, Carson here, and today I'm going to be reviewing Namecheap's email hosting plan. Now, if you're not familiar with Namecheap, they are primarily a domain register, which means that they do sell domain names, and that is their primary focus and goal. They also offer website hosting, which I have reviewed, albeit negatively, in the past, but I thought today I would go ahead and take a look at their email hosting and give you my general thoughts and feedback on that. Now, if you do want to check out more details and receive special discounts, go ahead and head down to my link right down in the description. And now, let's get into the video, but just a reminder that if you enjoy my content, remember to leave a like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you can be notified every time I upload. Now, starting at 90 cents per month, Namecheap's email hosting offers a free mailbox, 5 gigabytes of storage for emails, and 2 gigabytes for files. They let you personalize your display and obviously you're getting a custom email, which is very good for you because when you get a custom email, that allows you to look more professional when you are serving your customers. Instead of just having an email address at something like gmail.com, you will have a more customized email for yourself. Now, they also let you try any email hosting plan for free for 60 days, which to me is a pretty big benefit, and you can also create free alias email addresses. Honestly, I think Namecheap's email hosting is pretty good, but I do think they fall short in one main area, which is the fact that their website hosting is kind of a letdown. So even though their email hosting and their domain name register is extremely good, I think because their actual hosting plans fall a bit short, it really isn't worth it to go with Namecheap, especially because some websites like Bluehost Hostinger and HostGator offer free email plans with any hosting plan you buy. So even though I do think Namecheap is a very good website hosting provider, when you compare it to their overall hosting ability, and I actually don't think they are the best hosting provider you can go with for emails. A much better one would be a place like Bluehost.com, which also offers email hosting, but at a cheaper price and better quality. That is going to do it for this review though, so just a reminder that I do have a link in the description to both Namecheap and Bluehost if you want to check them out or receive special discounts. Thanks for watching. Remember to drop a comment if you have any questions for me. Leave a like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and I'll see you in the next video.